What up, y'all? It's your boy Ace here. Welcome to After News Delight. And I just got to make this video, man, because this is ridiculous, man. It's been like two weeks later. Two weeks later, y'all, man. And I'm still hearing these mugs still hating on Abby Steiner, bro. Or still talking junk about her. And it's been two weeks later, bro. Like, Abby season finished two weeks ago. Two Sundays ago. And I'm still hearing the Jamaicans talk about her, bro. I'm still, I, I've never seen, I, I don't think I've seen this in a while here on the track scene with someone still talking about somebody who ain't even been racing in like two weeks. All right. <laughs> so let, let's go through this first one. So my boy Javier Ramirez, shout out to Javier Ramirez, bro. Uh, we're going to focus on this part right here. So he says, I think Abby Steiner next year, Attorney Pro will be all the haters. Don't forget, she's only a college girl in gave them a run for their money so Chris Yang Lang uh, who I shouted out in my last uh, my last video said when exactly did she give her a run for her money and then Arlene Nunez said she did not until Shelly and Sharika hang up their spikes she will be beaten just so you know Jamaica has four <laughs> under 20 superstars coming honey think you see sprinting yet uh, damn this is bad English just you wait see the world will be stunned there is going to be fire on the track and if you i can't hardly wait so apparently like i know about the twins that's supposed to be coming up but apparently i've been hearing these jamaicans talking about some man we got this person we got this person coming up we got this person coming up i remember after uh soon after usain bolt retired yeah i've been saying this mess for like the last six seven years with the men Oh, we got these dudes coming up. The next Usain Bolt. The next Usain Bolt coming up, man. We got the next say we got the next Usain Bolt coming up. It's six, seven goddamn years later, and where is this Usain Bolt coming uh coming from that that y'all was hyping up? Six, seven years ago, y'all was hyping a few dudes up. And all that's happening is on the men's side that the the US men are starting to dominate. They swept the podium twice at the men's, the one hundred and the two hundred. And even on the women's side, who has been winning these relays lately? The U.S. They just won the U-20 for the uh, 4x400, bro. They just won that. I just saw the highlights. Roxine Willis, another Abby Steiner is coming, bro. Where is this talent that y'all say is coming, bro? Bro, dude, bro, y'all don't got nobody that's like Shelly Ann Fraser Price, Sharika Jackson, or Lane Thompson and Rod coming up. Stop it. You ain't got nobody like that. Even the twins ain't going to be on that level. Stop it. Stop it. Come on, man. And then this person said, I think you are wrong. She is a good athlete, but she won't be on the podium for a while. What do you mean she won't be on the podium for a while? I just made a video yesterday talking about how she would have been in the top three on all the events. 100, the 200, the 300, uh, the 400. What are you talking about? She won't be on the podium for a while. What are you talking about? Who else is in her way? The only person that's in her way is Sharika Jackson in the 200. What are you talking about? And maybe Sydney McLaughlin in the 400 if she decides to do that one. Ain't nobody else in her way. What are you talking about? What are you talking about? And then this person says, I know, right? They are coming. Fired. Man, get it. Man, y'all suck up in that hype. And here's the thing about the people that they keep hyping, right? So I'm hearing from um, respected track and field people from not just America, but like all over the world. I haven't seen none of them hyping up these Jamaicans that's supposed to be coming out. I haven't seen it. So I don't know what they seen. I haven't seen anybody else outside of Jamaica hype these athletes that's coming out. So what are you talking about? And then Arlie Nunez, this is the person that put that post out there. Uh, them a go shock out. Like that's it. This person in English is kind of bad. That 200 meter uh, specialist already ran the same time Elaine, a seasoned athlete, ran. She is going to be brutal. Then there are the twins. Let me hold it down. Let let them keep running their miles. They are not going to know what hit them. Okay. We ain't gonna know what what, what hit them. So when they get beat, what are you gonna say then? When they get beat. When they get beat. What are you going to say then? And if y'all talking about that one U-20 uh, athlete, she, 
her, her score was not that good, bro. Her time wasn't that good. And I don't even think that race, let me see what that 200 meter was. Let me see that 200 meter real quick. Here we go. So, what's her name? Brianna Liston, right? I don't know if this is the same person that this person was talking about. But this person got, this girl got a 22.65. Obviously, it's an amateur athlete, so, I mean, they're not really, their speed is going to be a little bit faster in the pro scene. But, so, I'm not holding too, too much shooting scores, but come on, man. That ain't nothing, man. 22.65, that ain't nothing, bro. Come on, man. Come on, man. You act like this girl got a 21.65 at her age, bro. Come on, man. Stop it. Stop it with the hype. Stop it with the hype, bro. And then, and then this person said, oh, yeah, that's my boy, Javi. Javi said this for the last one. Uh, apparently, you haven't been watching too closely. So let's go over here. Let's go to some more Jamaican smack talk in my comment section. Let's go over here. Let's go over here. Let's go over here. Let's see. Okay, this person says she can never be Sharika, even in Bamba is faster than Abby. <laughs> they be really believing in their own shit, bro. Now, like I said, it's going to be a challenge for Abby to be Sharika, but she can do it. That race was so close yesterday. I'm talking about some Jenna Prandini and Shawnee Miller Rebo. If they could run that close to Sharika Jackson yesterday, Abby could certainly do it. Okay? Okay, come on, man. And then this person said Mbamba is faster than Abby. Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> fuck out of here. Anybody's getting on Mbamba, bro. Get the fuck out of here, bro. And this person, I don't think this person was a Jamaican, but this person said, stop it. Every race is different. I love Abby, but give me a break. You don't love Abby. Shut the hell up. You do not love Abby, bro. An uh, Abby lover would not be saying what you said, bro. Oh, yeah. This, this, is, this is some more trash talk right here. Uh... So my girl Adeline Makata, Makata said, uh, Abby Steiner is resting up, but she will be better and faster when she comes back. I can't wait for Abby to return. Uh, Team USA's brightest star. Uh, Cheese Beef, oh yeah, the Cheese Beef said this one. Adeline, do you really think she could be Shelly Ann uh, in the 100-200? I think that's when I had said, yeah, she could be there in the 200. Because I was uh, I was making a point that she uh, she's resting this season. Uh, uh, I didn't even see what Cheese Beef said after this. He was talking some mess. Oh, come on, Cheese Beef. I got to put you on blast, bro. She said, yeah. I mean, Cheese Beef said, yeah. She might be Shelly Ann when she's 38 or 39. Might have not seen Worlds a couple of weeks ago. Blasted in orbit not to be found. Mommy Rocket. Plus anyone, uh, plus anyone that wanted to be Shelly Ann should have done it this year if they want respect for beating her. People get old. That's what we do. Okay. So, I think I made... Didn't I make that video not that... Like, a, a week or two ago about... She will be Shelly Ann? I think I made a video like that. I think I made a video like that. But, uh, let me just say this, man. First of all, I don't know how many times we got to repeat this over and over again. But, Abby was not even at 100%. She had, had dead legs when she raced in the Worlds. So that don't even count. That race don't even count at all. It don't count at all. I need to see Shelly Ann race the same way she did when Abby has fresh legs. Then I might be a believer. You know what I'm saying? But until I see that race, uh, you, you can't assume. You can't assume. And she's going to beat Mommy Rocket. Trust me. She's going to beat Mommy Rocket in the 200. All right, I said this before she retires, she's gonna get it. And Shelly probably ain't gonna be racing that old, so it'll probably be like if she is gonna hang it up, probably she probably gonna do like Alice and Felix did, probably hang them up, probably do another year 2025, uh, the Olympics is in 2024, but she'll probably do one more season after that just to do her world tour and she's gonna be out. But I don't think it's gonna take that long for Abby to be her. I think Abby could beat her as early as next year on some real talk. And then this is the last person. LOL, desperation. What about this would and should? What is stopping her from being there? Abby is not in u -Bow's class. This is the one. I think this one really motivated me to make this video, man. Because this person said one of the wackiest things I've heard in a minute. Stop the BS. No athlete runs their personal best in every race. So why are you calculating that Abby will always run PB? I don't remember saying that. This guy putting words in my mouth. 
what is Abby giving you to eat? Why are you guessing put Abby in a damn race? First of all, I don't know how many times we, if you're not paying attention, that's your problem. But Abby's season is over. She had 57 races this year. Her season is over. So why are you mentioning like she's ducking races? She ain't Shakari Richardson, bro. <laughs> she would have been racing yesterday if she was healthy, bro. Like she, her season is done, bro. She had 57 races. This is, see, this one right here, man. This is where I just got to be like, wow, what are you on, man? What are, what kind of drugs are you smoking, bro? What are you sniffing? You, Abby is not in Hugo's class. Someone that almost got beat by Jenna Prandini is not in Abby's, wow. Wow, Abby's not in her class. Abby's not in her class. Now, if you would have said, if you would have said Sharika Jackson, I would have, I would have, I would have respected that. I would have respected that. Shawnee Miller, you go, we bought me. Really? 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 Someone that barely beat Jenna Prandini yesterday is not in Abby's class? Abby would have beat both of them if she was in that race. <laughs> she didn't need to run her personal best to even get in the second place either. If Jenna Prandini could run Sharika Jackson down like that in her first 150 meters and Abby has better closing speed than Jenna Brandini, that would have been a real close race. She would have been in second for sure. Sean A. Miller, you, we both cannot beat Abby Steiner like that. Are you serious? Are you serious, man? See, it's on real haters, man. It's on real haters. This is why I can't wait for the season to start. This is why I can't wait for the season to start, bro. This is exactly why I can't wait for the season to start. Because, oh, my God. Oh, my God, man. Wow. Wow is all I got to say about that. Wow. Thank y'all for watching After News Delight. <laughs> wow.